Okay, AP Statistics, we are looking at example two for unit six. So this is another empirical rule example. So we have a manufacturing plant creating rods for engines, and they follow a normal distribution for the width with a mean of five centimeters and a standard deviation of 0.03. So there's our normal parameters. So we're gonna use the empirical rule as stated in the problem. So the first thing I'm gonna do is create our graph here, just like I did on the last problem. And I'm just gonna create it using the values for this particular problem. So I've got five plus 0.03, and again, and again. And then on the left, of course, I'm going to subtract 0.03 three times. And then, of course, the empirical rule values I've got here. And then I've got my other values that I'm just, this is just to, gonna make the problem easier to solve. So I'm just breaking this down into all the percentages. Make my life easier. Anything that does that is a good thing. Okay. So having done that, now I'm ready to um, set up my problems. So I've got part A, what proportion of rods are over 5.03? So I'm going to draw a picture here. That is not attractive, but I don't care. So I've got the center here, and then 5.03 is one standard deviation above. So I'm going to draw a line right there. What proportion of rods are over that? So I am going to shade and write an inequality, x greater than 5.03. And then of course, I'm just going to look at my picture and that's gonna be this right here. So that is going to be 16%. I just added 13.5 plus 2.35 plus 0.15. That's all I have to do with that. So that makes it nice and easy. And then I am going to look at part B. So what proportion of rods are under 4.94? So I'm going to, again, draw a graph, put five here. 0.494 is two standard deviations to the left. So 4.94. And I want the proportion under that. So my shading is going to go in that direction, x less than 4.94. And in my picture, that is going to be right here. So that's going to be 2.5%. And then in the next problem, if I have 50,000 rods are produced during the day, or during a day, how many would we expect to be between 4.94 and 5.06? Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and find that. So that's 5, 5.03, 5.06, 4.97, 4.94. So of course, those are two standard deviations, so that's 95% right there, right? So we're used to that. So I want um, the probability, of course, between those, which I already found, 95%. So I am going to multiply 50,000 by 0.95, and I get 47,500. That's how many I would expect. All right. Part D, what proportion of rods are between 4.91, oh, out of control, and 4.94? So 4.97, 4.94, 4.91. Dang it, why do I keep doing that? Okay, so shading there. 
inequality. And then of course on my graph, oops, did not mean to get rid of all of that. On my graph, that is going to be right here. So that's gonna be that 2.35%. And then part E, what proportion of rods are between 5 and 5.03? Again, with my graph here. Shading, my inequality. And this, of course, would be 34%. If you'll look up at your original picture here, that would be right there. So that is how we do these with specific problems. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy.